Are you looking to upscale your business website and move over to a BPS because it's faster, it's more secure, and you get root access? Well, you're going to get all of that with a Hostinger BPS. On this video, I'm going to show you how to grab a Hostinger BPS, how to install CyberPanel, and install a WordPress site. All of that in this video so you can get started right away. So let's go jump over to my desktop to show you what the deal is right now and how to accomplish all of that. So what's up everyone, my name is George and this is SaaS Master and we're gonna check out the BPS from Hostinger. Now, what is the deal? Well, they have great prices already, but they have an additional discount that you're going to get when you use the coupon code that I'm going to leave in the description. Now, they have plans starting off at $2.99 per month when you buy with some years in advance. And the most popular plan, which is the $49.99 a month plan, gets you the best bang for your buck. Now, depending on your website needs, select the plan that you need. For example, if you need two gigabytes of RAM, 40 gigabytes of SSD disk space, two terabytes of bandwidth, de de dedicated IP and full root access, well, this would be the plan for you. But if you need more RAM and if you need more disk space, then jump into the next plans. Now, they all have dedicated IP and full root access, which makes it really attractive with BPS plans. Now, dedicated IP means that you're not sharing your IP with someone else. And root access is really useful when you're installing uh, several types of sites, especially when you're installing PHP sites that need additional tweaking. So you get all of that. And if you need to check out all of these plans, what they actually get you one by one, you can check them out right here. Now, how do we apply that discount coupon code? Let's just go ahead and select this BP, BPS2. And once we selected it, like I mentioned before, um, there's a discount when you buy with some years in advance. So if you buy with 48 months, you get the cheapest price per month. So that's $4.99 per month. And like I mentioned before, there's an additional discount when you use the coupon code. All you have to do is I have a coupon code, select that there, add this coupon, SAS Master, and remember it's $239.52 right now. And if I add the coupon code, it goes to $222 with 72 cents. So you get an extra saving with that plan. So super easy to grab that plan. Now, let's jump over to the good stuff. How do we actually get started with the BPS and how do we install CyberPanel to get our WordPress site started? Okay, so I have this plan right here, which is the BPS Server Plan 2, and I'm gonna start the setup. Now, this is my H panel, and this is how you are going to get started when you buy your BPS plan. So let's get started right now with the process. And the first thing that it's gonna ask us is select the location. Now, depending where your clients are, your fans, or the most people who are going to view your website, select that country because that's where it's going to be hosted. And it makes it faster to give them look, access to the website. Again, select the one that best fits you, okay? So there's neither Netherlands, United States, Singapore, Tanya, and United Kingdom. I'll select United States for this one. And this is where the good stuff starts. So we get to choose the operating system. We get the OS with control panel, which is what we are going to install because we want cyber panel. That's going to be our BPS manager and that's going to help us install all of our sites, PHP or WordPress. And if you want a plain OS because you want to use a different type of BPS manager, well, you can select that also. And if you want a game server, that's possible also. In this case, we are going to select this one because we want cyber panel. And by default, it's selected, but I can choose a different one if I like. In this case, we are going to use Cyber Panel, so I'm going to continue, all right? And I'm going to name this VPS, and I'm gonna say uh, Cyber Panel Host, all right? And I'm going to add a root password for this, and I'll select something simple. There we go, I added the password. Let's go ahead and continue. All right, so again, it's confirming that this is the information that we want. Let's finish this setup. There we go. It should start installing our cyber panel hosting. Now let's give it a few minutes and we'll come back. Okay, our BPS is now installed and we have our cyber panel details to log in. So if you head on over to operating system, we have all the details for cyber panel, the login URL, the username and the password. So let's go ahead and jump over to this link to open up our cyber panel. So the username is admin, the password that we got. Let's go ahead and sign in. Let's save the password. And we are now logged into our cyber panel. Now in our cyber panel, we have a really important detail, which is this right here. This is our IP address. Remember we have our own IP address. Let's go ahead and grab this. And we're gonna use that to connect our website 
so we can go ahead and, and do the installation. So let's grab that IP. Let me go here into overview, grab the IP. Let me go into my DNS manager. Now, depending where you manage your DNS, it could be at Hostinger or any other hosting where you have purchased your domains. In this case, I have it tied to Cloudflare and this is where I connect all my domains to all the BPS that I have, okay? So I'm going to create a subdomain for my sasmaster.net website. And in this case, I am gonna say BPS Hostinger, that's what I'm gonna call it. And I'm gonna tie it to the IP address that I've got. So you can see this is going to be the domain, okay? So subdomain BPS Hostinger.sasmaster.net. So let's go ahead and save this. There we go. And let's go in back into our, whoops, our cyber panel. Here we go. And what we're gonna do is add our first website. So let's go ahead and create a website. Okay, we're gonna select package, our default package, select the owner, admin. If you need to create more users, go ahead and create them there and you can tie them to this. The domain name, so here we go. Remember we just created this, we tied it up. Our email address, here we go. Select the PHP version. Now this will depend what PHP version that you want to use. I recommend using 7.4 and over as of this video. In this case, I'll go with 8.0. And if you need additional features like installing the SSL, DKIM support, the open base DR protection, and create mail domain, go ahead and select all of that. In this case, I wanna keep it simple so it loads it fast, okay? But again, you can add those later if you like. So here we go. We've created the site. Let's go back, let's go into our websites. So list websites. Here we go. This is our first website, BPS Hostinger that's master. We are going to manage this website. Okay. And I'm going to scroll down here and I'm going to select WordPress. So application installer. So let's go ahead and select this. And for this one, I'll just call it BPS the login user. I'll say admin, the login password. I'll use the same one for my cyber panel, the email and if you want to install WordPress on a path, that means it's a subfolder. So no, I want to install it on the main site. So I'll go ahead and install now. Installing the Lightspeed Cache plugin. All right, there we go. Let's go back into our sites. Sorry, list websites. Here we go. Let's go into manage. So we should have WordPress installed now. So let's go ahead and over and try this domain. So let's go ahead and grab the domain name. Let's add another tab right here. Let's go into our site and there we go. We have our WordPress site now installed on the BPS and we're ready to use WordPress site. If you need to log in, go ahead and use the credentials for it. Go to your link, wp-admin and log in with the details that you've used when you create the WordPress site here on Cyber Panel. Tell me that wasn't easy. Installing a BPS, installing installing Cyber Panel, connecting your domain, and installing a WordPress site to start using it right away. Now you can go ahead and start customizing your WordPress site as you would like. But there you go. That is the BPS from Holsinger and installing Cyber Panel video. I thank you all for watching, and I'll see you on my next videos.